what's up everybody and welcome back so today in this video i am going to talk about the google play game services and mobile ads uh, problem so uh, whenever you uh, try to log into the uh, play game services the app immediately crashes so you can also view the message by using the android monitor or by connecting your phone to the android studio but uh, the problem actually occurs when you try to integrate both of these plugins so if you try one plugin then it will work fine but when you try to integrate both of them in a single project this causes the problem and uh, i have seen the discussion on forums and uh, as far as i understand the problem is with the plugin so actually uh, google uh, you know releases uh, different versions of play services and mobile ads so some of the jar files and the dot aar files they create the conflict between these plugins so what i did was so right now if you see the latest plugin here so the uh, google play games as of uh, you know 10 23 and 2019 0.9.64 is the uh, latest package so when you download this uh, you know uh, play games plugin you will get these files and in here you will see the old builds and current build so then uh, what i did was i switched back to the uh, older version so i tried the 9.62 but the problem still existed then i got to what is the 0.9.50 still the same problem but then i when i tried this 0.9.53 version which i am using right now this worked fine <coughs> now so what you actually need to do is so uh, also uh, i want to tell you about the unity version i am using i am using the 2019.1.14 and i have downloaded the uh, sdk and ndk by using the unity hub so uh, you have to you know uh, make sure which uh, version it supports so uh, you have to download the same sdk maybe it can cause problem but uh, the mostly uh, the recommended way is when you download the version of unity you have to go to the unity hub and from there you can uh, download the android sdk and ndk but uh, if you have uh, already sdk or ndk it will work fine but it is recommended to avoid any problem to uh, use the recommended and the download and install it by using the unity hub so uh, what i did was so if you ha already have some plugins in your game so what you need to do is you have to uh, you know f uh, start fresh so what i did was i uh, removed these folders so if you have google mobile ads play services play services resolver so this is the main culprit here and the plugins folder so remove all of them from your project by click clicking on the delete button now after that first you need to you know import the play services plugin okay so uh, as i tested the 0 0.9.53 package and it works fine so after that now you have to uh, import the mobile ads plugin but when you import this mobile ad plugin you have to do one thing so let's see if i have it right here so yeah so i am using the uh, latest version which is the version 4.0 uh, of ad mob so after you have uh, you know integrated the play services imported it uh, you can do one you have to you know then go to the uh, windows google play games setup and android setup and 
you have to set up the put the resources that you uh, copied from the your play store account and uh, do the resolution okay now after that when you import this uh, mobile ads so i am using the version 4.0 with the play services 0.9.53 now uh, when you do that you have to import everything but you have to uncheck this play services resolver So right now you can see I have imported everything but when you do that you have to you know uncheck this editor and select everything else so, you, so click on select all and then uncheck this editor here so I already have it so I am not going to import it now after that hopefully all of your problems will be gone but uh, sometimes add mob can also cause the crash and to fix that what you need to do is you need to go to this edit assets and go to this um, Google mobile ads and then click on the setting now here is the important thing here you have to you know you will have two options Google ad manager and Google ad Mob. so you have to enable it otherwise it will crash your app immediately so do that then go to the play services go to the play services resolver android resolver and resolve so if it resolves successfully hopefully you will have no problem so uh, there are actually a lot of issues uh, maybe this may not work for you so if uh, this is uh, this solution that i told you this is uh, specifically if you are getting the app crash okay so if you have uh, the login failed or other options then you can uh, watch my previous videos on the sign in failed problem and you have to do so if the sign in is failed it means there is no problem with the plugin but the problem is with your SHA and your on your uh, Play Store account there are a lot of videos on that you can check them out so that's it for this video guys and uh, I will see you in the next video